the best, the gold standard, and we've, we've been able to do this with one hotel, uh, but but I'll, I'll touch it as a gold standard, is to have the manager guarantee an NOI number. Uh, now, we do have that with one company who manages one of our hotels, where they're, now it's a low number. It's not necessarily a you know massive number, but there is a guarantee that, you know, we will, you know, we will, you, you, there's minimum, you know, call it, it's not a floating number, it's actually a, a dollar number. You know, minimum, let's say it's a, you know, small hotel, whatever, minimum 500K in NOI, right? Now that, talk about alignment and incentive, right? We're never going to get below that 500K or coming out of the management. That's a little bit rare, but that is like the gold standard. Um, what's, what's more common is you have kickers based on NOI, float, we like to use the flow through number, um, or we'll use a set number. So we'll say, um, we'll say, uh, let's say, let's say you get a, a management company and we'll say, okay, we'll pay you 3% off of revenue. But we have this, we have this uh, budget that we approve. So the, 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 the main control that you have when you're an owner and you have a third party operator, meaning you're, you yourself are not operating it, is approving the budget. That usually happens in October, November, we're going through it right now. Operator sends a, you know, let's say um, operator company sends me, a, you know, they work through it. They we say, okay, for our budget for this year, based on all the stuff we're looking at, you know, we're looking at the star reports, we're looking at what the hotel did last year, all this kind of stuff. Um, we're looking at the contracts we have in place for this next year. They say, um, we think that we're going to make two and a half million on top line and a million dollars in NOI and obviously every other number's in there. And we say, okay, um, we'll approve, you know, we'll, you know, we talk about it, blah, blah, blah. And as we get to approve it, we also approve the, the bonus structure for that year. And we'll say 3% off top line, fine, million dollars budget. If you hit the budget, we'll pay you an extra half percent, right? So, so the way that we're thinking about the budget is, okay, we need to make X. We have our own internal projections, right, from our investors and our things. But we say we have to make X. So we set the budget that we approve is slightly above that. We say, okay, if you hit that NOI number, you get an extra, you know, 1% off, 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 the, off the management fee on, on the revenue, so 3 or 4%. And then if you hit 20% above that, that goes to 5%. Right. And then if you, you know, and you kind of have this home run, you know, hurdles, but the flip side of that, and it is important to bring this up is they have to be hitting the hotel metrics on the, on the uh, guest service, um, guest, guest response surveys. So every hotel has this because the other way to hit NOI is to just, you know, take away every amenity, make it so that, you know, rooms aren't cleaned all that well. And you kind of just, you know, kind of take away all the things. And so, there's often these numbers that matter in the hotel. Marriott's size is called intent to recommend. The IHG one, I'll look it up. Uh, I can't remember the name, but it's it's kind of all these things, which says after you know, people stay in the hotel, they, they give back numbers. And we actually peg that into our management agreements too. Say, hey, yeah, you need to hit this NOI, but you also got to hit you know a 60% intent to recommend score because we can't have, yeah, we're making a lot of money, but no one's ever going to stay here again. It's only going to last for you know one year. And then you know every year after that, we're scraping the bottom of the barrel, Marriott's going to pull their flag, or going to pull their flag. So that's, that's, that's like the big incentive thing is NOI hits. As we hit certain NOI projections, then they get higher and higher incentives. Um, usually it's off of, we, we'll base incentives though off of the top line. So we're continuing to incentivize to bring top line, but instead of them getting 3% off top line, they'll get four or five, 6% off top line as they hit these NOI projections. And then like the, the, the check to that to make sure that they're not just, you know, ruining the guest experience is that you have to maintain the minimum, um, you know, guest service store score standards. Mm -hmm.